MidState is not necessarily your normal kitting supplier. Most kitting facilities, they buy product outside, they bring it in, they inventory it, they put it in boxes, and then they ship it. MidState doesn't do that. The thing that is most surprising for MindStar customers when they come to MidState is the diversity of what we're able to do at our facility. We are working hand in hand with the MindStar team on design and development of new parts, new products. We do all of our own processes in-house from um, paint, powder coat, laser form, weld, engineering, collaboration with customers on design, collaboration with them on their export crates. That's what made MidState such a good choice for doing this kitting project is because virtually everything is within our control and we're able to work very closely, not only with the MindStar customers, but also the people within the Caterpillar organization to make sure that we get the product that they're looking for. So at the end of the day, customer is going to see the quality that is part of what Caterpillar is all about. MidState strives to be more than just that customer supplier relationship. We strive to have a successful partnership with the MindStar team. So the seven step quality process is one that we developed to make sure that our parts went out with zero defects because of the issues they'd had in the past. You'll get seven sets of eyes. They all have a specific function and they all have an area that they're responsible for, but it's a repeat process to make sure that we don't have potentially any gaps where we could have someone that would miss a step and it doesn't get caught by the person behind them. It is not common for us to catch issues with it because of the degree of detail that we pay to make sure that everything is where it should be. It all begins with the kidding team and the person pulling that part from the shelf to the kidding table. We lay the parts out on the table by the order that they're on and we count out the quantities, make sure we have the right part, the right quantity, and then we get it ready for a second inspection. The second inspector comes through and rechecks all of our work and check marks all the parts that we laid down in an order to make sure that we check them the right way, we didn't miss anything. And so the second inspection is who brings the bag over to the bagging area. And then it comes to me and I check and verify that the parts and quantities are correct as well. She will take a still shot of a video and she will pull that up and she will review those pictures to assure she sees the same thing that the first two did. And then at that point, we have a four step that the person in sales reviews the same information that's provided by the team lead and they assure that everything is right. So after we get done pulling the bags, we bring them over to a large part area. We have crates and we put all these bags and totes in the crates and we package them into a huge crate that someone else builds here. Parts go to the crate packagers. There's two of those that also sign off that they are putting the correct bags and the correct interior crates that go in the large crates. And then it goes across my desk. I'm taking a look to make sure the bags are marked properly, they have the right part numbers on them, they're in the right interior wooden crates, and then that ultimately the crate is packed the same every time. And then the final step is then I will go through and make sure that all of the contents of the crate are where they're supposed to be, that they're properly marked, they've got the correct weights, and that's how we've been able to achieve the zero defect record that we have so far. We work extremely hard on the flow of the process. And it doesn't matter what size kit, doesn't matter what size crate. In our cases, it can be six, 700 part numbers. We try to do the same thing regardless. That process makes sure that the end user, when he gets his kit out in the field, can pull it apart and not have to worry about having missing parts, damaged parts, or not knowing how the kit is going to be pulled out of the crate and how it's going to go through the assembly process. And therefore, when that mechanic who's done the first one, by the time he gets number 15, he knows where he's gonna find that part. He knows where it's supposed to be. So that makes it efficient on their part. Time loss in the mine sites is tremendous. And we try to minimize that by making things consistent. That's a big thing that we bring to the table. We've been a supplier to Caterpillar for over 30 years. 
Caterpillar puts a tremendous amount of trust in MidState to assure that the product that we ship out the door is accurate, is efficient, and it has everything in it that they ask us to do. And we take that very seriously. We meet every week with the MindStar team and we discuss production schedules, shipping schedules, but we also talk about challenges. And because of the partnership we have with them, we work together to come to a resolution that makes sense not only for them, but also for MidState. The fact that we're able to do all that in-house and been able to do as well as we have with it, it is very rewarding. At night, you can go home and say, hey, we did a good job. Customers are happy. And if customers are happy, that's, that's what we're after.